Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. We've still got the earth signs. We're on Capricorn, um, the ram, and this is for December. Please understand that I work on a military basis. It will not resonate with everyone. It is not personal. It is general for Capricorns for December. I'm going to use the Element Tarot by Mind, Body and Spirit and then the Elemental Power Tarot by Melinda Lee Hun and see what we get, Capricorns. Okay. Trust your inner strength and reap the benefits. So you have that strength within you, Capricorn. Don't forget that. Feel that strength and use that strength to your advantage. Fire. Ignite the fire within you that connects you to the divine. Enlighten yourself spiritually. Dance around fires. Stare into candle flames. Bring forth the power within. Capricorn. <laughs> right. Let's get into our tarot now. And see what we have for Capricorn. For the symbol. These are the Elemental Power Tarot by Melinda Lee Horn. They are new. They were a gift. Anything else? Look, there's a lot here, really. Um, I'm just trying to get a picture, but I don't see too much happening. A lot of fire, though. A lot of fire, definitely. <clears throat> Could be a lot of passion. Who knows? Right. So, ooh, the five of wands, the five of sticks, five of wands, whatever you want to call it, fire, fire, energy, celebration, uh, coming together, jumping in feet first, taking chances, um, taking chances to celebrate and rejoice so there's a celebration of some sort and there's the leaping into the unknown um but enjoying every minute of it there's that big leap you and it's brilliant you know it all it works out perfect i mean i'll be honest when i was excuse me when i was dealing the cards and shuffling them capricorn i didn't feel like there was a lot to bring forward uh, just because I almost feel like you're at a good path in life right now and that you don't actually need a lot of insight which I don't get that happening a lot but yeah that's kind of what I had when I was doing it so this is good yeah taking those chances go for it then we have the four of wands, four of sticks, however you want to call it. Again, full fire energy.
but you see we also have the three as well which is unreal wow and the eight so we we have all these and all these are fire and they're all wands or sticks and so fire energy um it's this is there's something happening quite big regarding family and the home there's celebrations to be had on missed out time um unity there's a coming together definitely coming together um it's Focusing on the the focusing on those around you. Um see all these they are all so um that's what I'm looking for. So much energy. So much energy bursting, bursting energy, um celebration. Uh, being able to come together and celebrate, celebrate, so that's all I'm getting is this, these big celebrations happening around you and within the family and you're, um, you've set boundaries as well for some reason, there's boundaries but everything works out fine and I'm get, I am just getting this, this celebratory thing at the moment, coming in that's needed, uh, because you've not had the time, you know, together. You've not had the time together, so it's kind of needed for you to just release. Um, there's also something regarding you finding solutions for old problems that are niggled at you. Uh, it's the fact that there has been a problem of some sort, personal to yourself, Capricorn, and their new a new solution arrives within these celebrations for this old problem that you then fix. When that's fixed, it brings forth more celebration. And I'm literally honestly, I am seeing a lot. I'm just seeing a lot of family gatherings and celebrating. Um, but it feels almost it's been too long. Like, it's been such a long time, it's been too long, and this is just that over-emotional energy of finally, you know, getting together, being able to work through things in the past from, from new guidance, and then that brings forth more celebrations. So, there is a lot going off, for, you know, celebration-wise with with yourself and, and your family members around you. Um, fun times, definitely fun times to come and, and to continue for a while, I would think, with these. Because, you know, I do, like I say, I work on energy. And honestly, the energy is like, yeah, it's blazing. Bla it's absolutely blazing to the point um, where I'm just... I'm just just par partying, but not not in a bad way. So, in a really positive, celebrative way, you know, like um, fun and frolic and laughter and merriment, family getting together, having a big meals. I don't know Christmas is coming, but this is more than that. This is not just that. This is more. Um, this is finally being able to uh, celebrate other things that you've not been able to. Um, yeah, it's lovely. It's, it's really really nice. Then we have the chariot. And the chariot has a bit of every energy. It's known for cancer, but um let's see. Wading through, wading through, being guided, looked upon. Crossing the mountains when the calm seas finally come. Right, okay, so let me see the chariot. 
you have someone watching your video, whether that be spiritual or person on you know around you, that they are definitely watching over you in a very positive way and there to help you if needed. And this is kind of like trust the process, trust the way things go because they are meant to go this way for a reason and understand that there is support around you so when you feel overwhelmed um, with emotions because of the uh, family getting together the you know the, all that happened at once can be quite over emotional and you've traveled you know you've gone over mountains and you've hit that you've hit bumpy roads and you're finally there wading through the plants but you do have support to bring in the calm to bring the ride back to being smooth you have the support around you and people willing to be there for you now especially after these celebrations because it just brings more closeness more bonding you know and it brings that help because you're you are being guided and there is someone around you that cares for you a lot and is willing to come in and step and take that burden that you feel at some point and take it off you um, and once you get to the other side <clears throat> and that journey's done you're grounded you're back to being earth grounded balanced you are you have opportunities becoming available to you and these are of growth they are of wisdom and knowledge they are new skills in which you can learn to better your life better your life for people around you so the chariot is there to guide you to these opportunities of growth and abundance to hopefully growing your money you know being able to put away for a rainy day watching it grow growing your knowledge your wisdom and understanding that everything in your life happens for a reason and to be settled and in harmony you know with yourself with your inner self and with the people around you it's very good capricorn it's it's lovely so let's see if we have any guidance for our Capricorn, please. Guidance for our Capricorn would be lovely. Oh gosh, okay. <laughs> Throw it out of there. Fair enough. The moment I embrace my peace within and surrender the outcome is the moment that the universe can truly get to work. So remember, things happen for a reason. Embrace the new. Embrace the change. And surrender to get to where you need to be. Hope is the conduit for miracles. Miracles can happen, you just have to understand and believe in the cycle of life and the fact that if you have the hope for the miracle to happen, it will happen. <laughs> the universe has my back. Now, this is the ultimate card in this deck because this deck is called The Universe Has My Back. And this is exactly that. It's telling you that you have no worries. The universe is watching over you. The spirits are watching over you. They are bringing... That's the other side of the car, by the way. They are going to make sure that everything is as it should be. They're going to guide you the correct way. You have nothing to fear. The universe understands, is willing and wanting to help. Fear nothing, for the universe has your back. Capricorn. How lovely is that? It's always nice 
and we'll have the universe watching over us. I think, well, you know, everybody does, but you would just have it more so. <laughs> Remember, it won't resonate with everyone. Take what you can, leave the rest behind, please. It's only general for December for Capricorn. Love and light, thank you so much for watching. Blessed.